Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel Canada Immigration. We hope you're doing great. Well, in this episode, we'll be talking about new Manitoba draw target specific occupations for Canada Immigration. So, to get all the information, pay attention, and watch the video through to the end please hit, like, and subscribe in Manitoba in one of the following occupations. 1. Transport and Transit Drivers, 7330. 2. Retail and Wholesale Trade Managers, 6002. 3. Nursing and Allied Health Professionals, 3130. For Assisting Occupations in Education, 4310. 5 secondary, elementary and kindergarten school teachers, 4122. 6 hairstylists and aestheticians, 6321. 7 automotive service technicians, 7241. 8 paraprofessional occupations in legal, social, community and education services, 4220. 9 retail salespersons and non-technical wholesale trade sales and account representatives, 6410. 10 Office Support and Court Services Occupations, 1410. Meanwhile, skilled workers in Manitoba candidates in all occupations received 298 LAS, with a minimum score of 693 points. International Education Stream candidates received 51 LAS the remaining 27 LAS went to skilled workers overseas candidates, through a strategic recruitment initiative, with a minimum score of 721 in a separate draw on February 24. Manitoba issued 13 invitations as part of its special immigration measures for Ukraine. To qualify, candidates must a be a citizen of Ukraine, b have a minimum of CLB4 in each language band, c have established connection to Manitoba, close relative, family-like, community, previous employment or studies in Manitoba, d have a valid language test, and E score at least 60 points according to MPNP assessment criteria. Manitoba stated that 140 of the 583 candidates invited had valid express entry IDs and job seeker validation codes. For detailed requirements of all the streams featured in this draw, please see below. What were the details of the latest Manitoba draw? How do you qualify for the skilled worker in Manitoba stream? The skilled worker in Manitoba stream is based on the specific needs of Manitoba employers SWM selects foreign trained workers with the required skills and nominates them for Canada permanent residence. The stream prioritizes candidates with a strong attachment to Manitoba, with two pathways to Manitoba immigration. A Manitoba work experience pathway, for applicants currently working in Manitoba on temporary work permits, through the temporary foreign worker program or as international graduates from any province candidates do not need to be working in in-demand occupations. B. Employer Direct Recruitment Pathway, for applicants from overseas with job offers from approved Manitoba employers. How do you qualify for the Skilled Worker Overseas Stream? The Skilled Worker Overseas Stream includes both a dedicated Canada Express Entry Pathway and a direct provincial pathway. Strong family connection to the province. B. Human Capital Pathway For international skilled workers with skills, training, and experience in one of Manitoba's in-demand occupations candidates must demonstrate potential to find employment soon, after they arrive in Manitoba. What are the requirements for the International Education Stream? The International Education Stream is dedicated to international graduates from Manitoba colleges and universities. Under IES, candidates are no longer required to work for six months in their field before applying for an MPNP nomination. It has three pathways. One Career Employment Pathway. Eligibility requirements include completed a one-year or longer course from an eligible post-secondary Manitoba institution within three years of submission of. Application have a full-time job offer in a Manitoba in-demand occupation related to the completed degree. Resident of Manitoba. Two graduate internship pathway, master's and doctoral degree holders who have completed MITAX Accelerate or Elevate internships can apply for nomination through internships even without a job offer in the province. 3. Student Entrepreneur Pathway Eligibility requirements include 
a completed a two-year or longer course from an eligible post-secondary Manitoba institution. B. Six months business operation experience in Manitoba. C. Resident of Manitoba since graduation. D. No specific minimum personal net worth requirement. That is all for today, in this video. What are your thoughts on this? Please let us know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching the entire video. Hopefully, the information is useful to you. See you later, in the next episode. Till then, take care.